and today you are coming along with me as I do boring house things. You know what I'm talking about. Boring house things. Things you have to do around the house that are boring slash annoying. If you're new around here, around these parts to my channel, this little, this, welcome. I have ADHD. <laughs> in case you couldn't tell. And with that comes executive dysfunction, which is a problemo that neurodiverse people face, which is the struggle with getting things done. Like little simple, meaningless, should be easy to do things, but they're just not. They're just like too darn hard for whatever reason. Our brain just decides that it's too hard and it's like not worth it and we're just gonna put it off for eternity. So my goal here on this channel is to motivate you, the viewer, to get a little thing done around your house, a big thing done, a couple of things done, whatever. Because I find that when I have somebody on FaceTime or when I'm on the phone with somebody or even when somebody's here at the house or if I'm watching a YouTube video, I tend to get up and go do the stuff. And it just like motivates me. It's called like buddying up. It's like the buddy system, like just having someone there to help you get up and do things. So that's me. I'm that person for you. And by the transitive property, you're that person for me as well. Here we go. We're helping each other do things. There's a couple of things on this list today, starting with activating my Ashley Furniture credit card to make the payments for my new couch. Look at my new couch. Oh my God. Look at her. I cannot believe I have a freaking chaise lounge sofa. What? I truly thought in all of my days, I would like literally never own that. Never have that ever. But I do. I have that. And like, it fits great. It's great. Everything's great. She's like a navy blue. She looked more tealish in the store, but that's okay. I dig her blueness. I'm blue. I'm neen, I'm nigh. Okay. Anyway, I forget what I did. Did I set up automatic payments? I don't know. The guy helped me at the store. He also gave me his number and then ghosted me. Fun! Okay. <laughs> So I'm gonna get started on that in a second. But before we get started, please enjoy today's featured black creator. Hey people, this is Ty Gibson, AKA, yeah, it's Ty G. He just hit 6 million on TikTok, which is insane. <laughs> um, he does a lot of like sketch comedy and like little skits. As you can see, he's playing like a lot of characters. But my favorite bit that he does is when kids roast each other because it just reminds me so much of my students at my old jobs. It's the best. Check it out. Oh, oh stop looking at me. Stop touching me. Stop touching me. You dang. Oh, you like a rested on elbow and you build like a sat on butt cheekbone. You, you, you know what? You smell like, you smell like mayonnaise without the E on the end, you dumb, 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 dumb doofus. Ugly. Who you calling dumb? Who you calling dumb? You built like the toenail that's looking to the left. Bruh, shut up with your droopy palm tree neck built self. Ugly neck leaning this way and your thoughts up at the ceiling. Stupid. You just lopsided. You built like a shull up. That's probably why the back of your neck smell like glazed oranges and funyuns. And your breath smell like box tops and dry glue scraggly. Scraggly. Oh, that guy. Oh, that guy. You the perfect example of if stank, so stank stank was a person. And that's on a big old dot. Ooh. 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 You built like a dot. You won't. You won't. Stupid. You so stupid. You stupid. Stupid head. You so stupid. Just stupid. And you built 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 like a and you built like an ironing board with your four with them four hair wrinkles. Now go move. <laughs> yeah, you get the idea. Some of his humor is like not exactly my thing, but give him a follow. You won't regret it. Okie dokes, here we go. Step one. Call to activate your card. See sticker on card for toll free number. This entire call will be recorded and monitored. Hi, thanks for calling to activate your Synchrony Bank credit card. Please hold while I update your account. All right, your activation's all taken care of. Hey, I can also text you the confirmation with the web link. Not only will the site have your account info, but it'll have other helpful things like auto pay and your FICO score. How about it? Want to text? Yes. She's nice. Okay, you should see it any minute. 
if for some reason you don't, the info will be on your statement too. Okay, she keeps blabbing. I'm gonna log in or register or whatever so I can set up auto pay. This isn't really a house thing, it's like a computer thing, but I'm counting it. Okay, yeah, that's me, that's my account, continue. Oh my God, so many security questions for a freaking couch. Unavailable, you're unavailable. Congratulations, you successfully registered for Consumer Center. Okay, go to my account. I wanna set up auto pay, I love auto pay. Auto pay off, I want it on, fix that. Auto pay on, enroll in auto pay, heck yeah. How much would you like each month? Okay, the camera cut me off and I don't know where. My routing number's not working, I don't know what's happening. This is so annoying. See, annoying, boring, annoying house things. Oh, my car payment's due today, cool. Good thing I have auto pay. <laughs> Why is it not working? Oh, that's asinine. That's literally insane, I have no idea why it's not working. Okay, I'm just gonna call the customer service number. That's literally asinine. It's free in our automated system. And if you prefer to pay your bill, you... Set up auto pay. Could, sorry, I don't have that information. From here, you could say, I want to speak to an agent. I want to speak to an agent. Thank you for calling Synchrony. My name is Christy. Hi, this is Alana. Thank you so much. And how may I help you? I just activated my card. I'm trying to set up auto pay and log into the app, and it's not letting me do either of those things. Uh, I'm really sorry for that trouble. Do you want me to set up the auto pay for your account? Yeah, I was trying to put in my routing number. It's just saying it wasn't working. And I'm like, nope, that's definitely right. <laughs> so I don't know what to do. All right, ma'am. The auto pay has been set for your account, okay? Oh, thank you so much. Now I'm trying to log into the app and I'm using the email I just used and the password I just made and it's like literally not letting me do it. Do I need to create an account on the app and also mysynchrony.com or those two separate apps? apps? Yes, two separate apps. Ah, separate apps. oh, a Synchrony app, not an Ashley app. Yes, that's correct, my Synchrony. Okay, yeah, let me do this because I like to look at my statements every month. Anything else that you would like to know? I just want to make sure that I can log into the app. Would you mind staying on the phone with me for just like sure. another minute? Okay. No problem. Yes, yes, I'll wait. Aha, great, amazing. Yes. Thank you so, so much. Thank you. You're welcome, ma'am. You're welcome. Anything else that you would like to know? No, I'm good for now. Have a great day. I appreciate your business with Synchrony. You have a great day. You too, bye. That's done. Next. My car registration gotta be renewed March 2021, which is like in five days. Uh, that's somewhere in my email somewhere. Renew your registration now. Hopefully this is painless. What are you renewing? Boat, no, I'm just kidding. Vehicle, phone number, passenger, zip, email, email, continue. Error. The information does not match what we have on file. Well, that's your problem. Oh, I definitely put my phone number instead of my plate number. Okay, plate number. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> I definitely saw the letter P and just thought it said phone number. There I am. Ooh, I can keep, oh, freaking frack fruck. <gasps> Oh, we got the new plates. The new plates with the, um, hold the frickin' phone. It's more expensive to keep your plate number than it is to change your plate number? Oh wait, no, 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 no. The least expensive is to keep the gold and keep your same plate. The next expensive option is to change to the new white with the blue and yellow that says Excelsior on the bottom instead of Empire State. <laughs> Did we change our slogan? What is Excelsior? What does that mean? Why do the new New York license plates say Excelsior? According to Democrat and Chronicle, the state's motto, Excelsior, is written in gold below the license plate Number. Okay, so Excelsior means ever upward. We're going upward. Okay, apparently we're no longer the Empire State. We are now Excelsior. <laughs> that sounds kind of cool. It sounds like something from Marvel. I got Marvel on the brain because I'm watching the entire MCU in release order. It's a journey. I'm watching one movie a night. It's a lot. It's a lot, but it's fun. Okay, I'm gonna go with keep current plate. Keep. A hundred and twenty-seven dollars? Is that what it is every three years to re-register your car? I don't remember it being that much. I mean, I haven't done it in three years, but I don't remember it being that much. Yikes a doodles. Okay, not really into that price, but such is life, I guess. Okay, I agree. Keep my same plate. Yeah. I used to hate the yellow when that was new, and now I kind of like it. Card number. Bada bing, bada boom. Looks good. Submit payment. 
Thank you. Transaction complete. And then what do they do? They send me the thing. Download temporary registration document. Does your New York car registration expire at the end of the month on the sticker? I think it's the end. It has to be. It's not like March 1st. All right. I'm just going to download the temporary registration anyway. I think that's a smart move regardless. Okie dokie. Next. Great, those were two things that were like eating at my soul. Next, oh my God, look what I got in the mail. <gasps> it's the new ColourPop Valentine's Day collection blush. First of all, this packaging is like matte and smooth. It's the pink one, my type. Look how cute though, look how cute, look how cute. Mm. Oh my God, it's so hard to open actually. Mm. Oh my God, this was worth every cent. The shipping was kind of ridiculous, but worth it, worth it, worth it. Look how cute the little um, unicarton is too. Oh, I feel like I have to keep it, but like for what? I don't know. Okay, next annoying thing. Put these gigantic C batteries up in my keyboard because the plug is a little funky. It's not doing what it needs to do and I'm over it. So we're gonna put in these batteries as like a backup plan, you know? I would like to see batteries. This back here, it's so messed up. There's a paper clip stuck in it. It's a whole thing. It's a whole to do. It's a whole thing. Oh boy. Ugh. Okay. Can you see? Oh. Okay, random. Oh shoot, do I need like way more than this? Oh dear. Huh. Wait, is it literally like you just need a whole bunch of them like straight? These have been in here for 870,000 years. Did I need more? I might have needed more. Shoot. Is this not even the same? That's not even the same size, Alana! Did I just go to Dollar Tree and get the wrong ones? <gasps> They're D's and I bought C's. Oh, that's so awkward. Frick, I was just at Dollar Tree. That pisses me off to the nth degree. Wow. Okay, never mind on that, I guess. Okay, guess I'll have to do that another time. That's so irritating. I can't believe it was D, but I even looked at the D's and I was like, no, it's not D, it's C. Oh, okay. That's so annoying. Okay, guess this goes in my battery drawer. That doesn't even fit. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. That's too many batteries. Okay. Oh, Chanel. -y. <laughs> Is that comfy? Aww. Ugh. Okay, next. This is so annoying. It's too slippery. So I'm putting this grippy stuff under it. I've been putting this off for 18 centuries. I think this is technically drawer liner stuff, but I use it for rugs. I don't know. I don't care. It's still slidey. Why? Oh no, that's better. That's better, that's better. Okay, good. I need a better system for this highlighter situation, dude. This is not it. Did you hear Becca's going out of business? Oh my God, weird, weird. That's the best I can do. Oh, oh there we go, there we go. The sliding sucks. Next, putting the pad in the bralette. If you know, you know, this is the most annoying thing in the world. So much so that I literally like specifically saved it for this video. This is the most boring, most annoying thing, dude. Like just another way women are oppressed. Just like the, mi it's the minute things, you know? It's the little things. Okay, that wasn't that bad. <laughs> Done. I can't believe that batteries thing, man. Damn it. What time is it? Oh my God, it's already five. I have to go.
Okay, thank you so much for watching this small video. I hope it inspired you to get a little something done or perhaps a big something done. And if not, that's totally cool. You'll try again tomorrow or some other day. It's fine. Time literally isn't real. If you like this video, like this video, as in literally click the thumbs up button down below, please. You have to be logged into a YouTube account in order for that to work. Make one. You have one if you have a Gmail. If not, make one. It's really easy. Um, and if you want to see more stuff like this, AKA me doing things, please consider clicking the subscribe button. It's big, it's red, it says subscribe, and after you click the subscribe button, you have an option of clicking a notification bell, which lets you know when I upload, it like gives you a little notification. You know what a notification is. Thank you so much for coming along with me, Alana. Hence the channel name, along with Alana. Okay, bye! <laughs>